The Covenant is an upcoming action thriller war movie. I don't remember any of it. I only remember the interpreter. Starring one of the major names from Hollywood, this movie promises to be a heavy one in terms of violence and emotion. But that hasn't stopped us from getting excited about it. Whether you have an emotionally charged character or simply love a war drama, this film has something to offer to everyone. And from its released trailer, this film looks to be a gripping and emotional roller coaster. So keep watching this video to find out everything you need to know about The Covenant from the plot to the cast to the release date and much more. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, The Cine Wizard. Why you want this job? I need the money. Don't disappoint and turn out to be a pain in the ass. Money isn't the reason he wants this job. From the Affleck brothers to Drew Barrymore and her relatives, there have been many families of stars that have graced our screens over the years. And one such family is the Gallen Halls. Both director Stephen Hall and screenwriter Naomi Foner were well respected within the film industry. Taliban killed his son. Stop the vehicle, Sergeant. We don't want to go down this road. That's why they decided to allow their children, Maggie and Jake Hall, to work within the same field as themselves. While both grew up as successful child actors, it was Jake who really flew the highest. With consistency throughout the last 20 years, he has become a mainstay on our screens and a household name. He even picked up an Academy Award nomination for Best Actor and two Golden Globe nominations along the way. You're out of your bounds, Ahmed. You're here to translate. Actually, I'm here to interpret. Now all eyes are on Jake as he gears up for his upcoming role in this movie. We are so excited about this movie and we are here to give you everything we know about it. Well, the movie follows the story of Sergeant John Kinley and interpreter Ahmed, who are on a mission in Afghanistan. Kinley recruits Ahmed to help him communicate with the locals and navigate through the rough terrains of the area. But little did they know that the mission would turn into a life-threatening situation when they encountered the Taliban in the desert. Kinley gets knocked down by the enemy, and Ahmed saves his life by taking down the rest of the Taliban and dragging him through the desert mountain. Ahmed has his reasons for joining the mission, and it wasn't just for the money. He wanted to seek revenge on the Taliban for killing his son. After returning to his homeland, Kinley learns that Ahmed is being pursued by the Taliban and is trapped somewhere in Afghanistan. Despite his requests for help from the authorities, Kinley decides to take matter into his own hands and goes to rescue Ahmed. Will he be able to save his friend in time, or will he also face the same fate at the hands of the Taliban? You will have to watch it to find out. The official tagline of this movie reads, follows Sergeant John, who is on his last tour of duty in Afghanistan, is teamed with local interpreter Ahmad, who risks his own life to carry an injured John across miles of grueling terrain to safety. For three weeks, his family believed you were dead. Now he's hiding in a hole somewhere. I should be in that hole. It's easy to get caught up in the main characters, but a strong ensemble cast can really make or break a movie, and the casting team for this film did not disappoint. They had the difficult task of finding actors who could match Jake Gyllenhaal's captivating presence on screen, and they have done just that. Joining Jake is Dar Salim from Game of Thrones, Christian Achoa Lavernia from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. as Eduardo Hernandez, and Sean Sager from The Gentleman as Charlie Crowther. And that's not all. There are even more talented actors who have been announced for the movie, but their roles have not yet been revealed to the public. These include Alexander Ludwig from Vikings, Emily Beecham from The Fane, Anthony Starr from The Boys, and Jason Wong from Dungeons & Dragons, Honor Among Thieves. The ensemble cast for this movie is truly stacked with experience and talent. First of all, as we mentioned before, Guy Ritchie is both the director and writer of the film. We owe that man your life. There wasn't enough for him to carry me across those mountains. That is already a big reason why many people are eager to pre-order their tickets for opening night. But he's not alone in writing the script. Ivan Atkinson, 
who previously worked with Richie on The Gentleman and Aladdin, and Marn Davis, who also have collaborated with Richie on Sherlock Holmes and The Gentleman, are also on board. These three have a proven track record for making successful films together, so it's safe to say that The Covenant will be another addition to their impressive portfolio. Everything all right, John? No, everything's not all right. There is a hook in me. But that's not all. The cinematographer of the movie is Ed Wild, who previously worked on Rocket Man. When you consider the talented crew, incredible cast, and thrilling plot, it's no surprise that Guy Ritchie's The Covenant is already being hailed as one of the most anticipated action movies of 2023. Ahmed and his family are in trouble. We can't intervene. So if you are a fan of Richie's previous work and just love a good action movie, make sure to mark your calendars and get your tickets early for it. This movie is going to be one for the ages and we can't wait to see it on the big screen. Yes, we definitely have a trailer which literally is packed with excitement and thrill. The trailer release was a welcome surprise for fans in the post-pandemic era where delays have become the norm. The trailer is filled with tension and showcased Richie's signature style of high-octane action sequences with big-budget explosions. I am gonna have to get him out myself. The setting in Spain adds to the mood and tone of the film. The trailer's score by Christopher Benstead and the use of Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers, Ivan back down, adds to the sense of impeding doom. Listen, you gotta be alone. There ain't no if you can give me the location if I can get him out of the country, it's too dangerous. The narrative of unlikely friendship and internal conflict is relatable, making it both action-filled and emotional. Fans of this genre are sure to be excited after watching the trailer. You gotta adapt. Here's what you got. In January 2022, it was revealed that MGM had obtained the distribution rights for this war film. Since then, fans have been eagerly anticipating a release date. Finally, it was announced that the film would hit US theaters on 21st April 2023. Interestingly, while MGM secured distribution rights for the US, Amazon Prime's obtained the rights for international distribution, which means that the film will be available on Amazon Prime Video worldwide on the same day. You've become very popular with the Taliban. So are you a fan of Jake Gyllenhaal? Then tell us in the comments section about your favorite film of Jake. Meanwhile, subscribe to this new wizard and stay updated about all the upcoming films and TV shows. I miss you. Love you, Daddy. Love you, Daddy.